We're all so much stronger than we think we are. And you wouldn't believe what you can accomplish if you start talking about yourself and thinking about yourself in the light you deserve to be. So, yeah, today started out like any other day. You wake up, do your normal routine, but you never expect to find out you're dying. As far as I know, I'm healthy my days left on this blue ball floating through an internal abyss are counting down. Have you, have you ever contemplated and really realized that tomorrow is never guaranteed? This is exactly why I live the way that I do. Not for you or for them, but for me. When that day eventually comes and I'm forced to put the last period on the last page of my book, I want to be satisfied with the pages that led up to that last drop of ink. People spend their whole lives in denial of death when birth and death are the only guarantees. The cover and the back are the only guaranteed pieces of paper in your story. Don't you want to read the story written about your life? I'm not saying you have to travel the world and see every continent and culture on this blue planet. That's just what sets my soul on fire. What makes your story worth reading to you? Not me, not them, but you. They don't matter. The only thing that matters is that when that day finally comes, you are content with leaving. You embrace death because you embraced life. So tell your friends you love them. Tell your family how much they mean to you and never let them forget it. Call that person you've been aching to call. Start that business, try something, fail, and try again. Whatever it is that makes your heart pound, do it. Do it for you and no one else. Because it's your story and only you hold the pen.
That is the. You can't see an ass. You're gonna read about it tomorrow. I, <laughs> I, will, I will find it for you. This find it. Wait, I believe you. It just was something fl like flaming coming across the sky. That was a flaming. <laughs> it was flaming, dude. It was okay, white wait. in the middle. Okay, wait, you lost me. I swear. To God. No, I believe him. I swear. I, I don't believe him. I would not make it. this up. No, that hand movement really sold me. I don't know about y'all. It came from here, and I was looking right here, and it just came in frame for a Seriously? second. Seriously? Yes, it went right over the ridge line. It was like a flaming ball. I've, oh seen, my God. I've never seen anything like this in life. <laughs> Wait, that's it. I, no, no, no. It, it was, didn't look scary. It's <laughs> <laughs> it was really cool. What's your name? Ezekiel! What's your name? Tony! F you, Tony! F you, Ezekiel! You see those rocks over there? I put the fire with them last night. Better f your mom next to it. F you, Tony. F you, Ezekiel. <laughs> and tonight, for dinner, we're having chicken and rice. Cold. But we have this bussin', bussin' sauce from Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> <laughs> discomfort today, <laughs> nope, <laughs> but this is going to make tomorrow so much more comfortable, and tonight, so nice. Yikes! <laughs> Kenton, thank you so much for giving me an extra chain. We're gonna see if we can fix this. <laughs> that he'll, he'll feel good at least. Yeah, he'll feel great. Did you see me like? <laughs> <laughs> oh, excuse me. Can I ask you a huge favor? Can I ask you a favor? I'm driving or riding my bike across the country right now. And I just ran out of water. And it's a pretty tough hill. Can I get some? <laughs> I know you were a little confused. Like, who's talking to me right now? You're a lifesaver. This hill is not easy. It's been a 
long day already. Hey, don't fall over again! Out of it. Alright. Here we go. Like hard. What is your dream? Wow. Um, how much time do you have? Uh, what's your dream? So, um, yeah, I, I, I've told you how passionate I am about, uh, about cycling. I would love to do what you're doing. That's my dream. Right there. That's as simple as that. I would love to get on my bike and go ride across the country. What's stopping you? That's the thing I live for like the last, ever since college. I've always been like, that was the last like, summer of my life. <laughs> and here I am still doing summers in this way. <laughs> Keep the summers alive. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.